Hey guys, Yunus here from Mr. Lava English Tech. Let's review. And Redmi K series has launched in China and we are going to review this smartphone. I have it in my hand and we quickly have to take a look what Redmi K series has to offer this time. But before, please consider to subscribe to my channel so you won't miss any update from my channel. So let's get started. Redmi has finally launched the new Redmi K60 series in China. The new lineup includes the Redmi K60, Redmi K60 Pro and Redmi K60e. In this post, we will stick to the Redmi K60 Pro model. The former Redmi K60 brings a Snapdragon 8 Gen 1 while the later packs the latest Snapdragon 8 Gen 2 chip. The higher-end Redmi K60 Pro fronts a 6.67-inch Chinese 2K display with 1440p resolution. The panel supports a 120Hz refresh rate, a peak brightness reach 1400 nit, 16 8.7 billion colors and a P3 color gamut. 480Hz touch sampling rate, users get an array of display features like Dolby Vision, SDR 10 Plus and DC dimming. The Redmi K60 series have a sensor that automatically adjusts the color temperature and there is a fingerprint sensor underneath the display. Redmi introduced Auto Brightness 2.0 an algorithm learning with the time about how the device is used, providing the needed brightness for each process as desired by the user. The handset will draw power from Qualcomm's latest Snapdragon 8 Gen 2 processor, paired with up to 16 GB of LPDDR5X RAM and 512 GB of UFS 4.0 storage. On the software side, users will get the new MIUI 14 custom skin based on Android 13. It is also equipped with a 5000mm2 super large VC heat dissipation system. The punch hole front camera supports 16 megapixels which can record up to 1080p 60fps. I hope this phone supports 4K in front camera. Redmi executives were extremely proud to talk about the new camera on stage. The main one on the back is a 50 megapixel shooter with a Sony IMX800 sensor behind OIS and EIS. The company brought improved object recognition for its own AI filters. Also, it said experience and quality would be equal to using a film camera, which obvious improvements in processing speed and development. A new algorithm helps for faster capture too, which is an important improvement over the old Redmi K50 series. The other two cameras are nothing out of the ordinary, an 8 megapixel ultra wide shooter with 120 degrees FOV and a 2 megapixel macro sensor. This Sony IMAX 800 lens supports up to 8K 24fps UHD video recording. And lots of people are happy because this phone can record 4K 30fps and 4K 60fps. It's perfect for cinematic footage. The best part what I like in this camera is while shifting the lens, the colors are not changing. This shutter range is more versatile. The camera can be used in dimmer light and it just seems more useful and sensible in everyday conditions. And with improvements to the algorithms, you can get clear photos at longer zoom levels as well. The connectivity options include NFC, Bluetooth 5.3, Wi-Fi 6E and dual frequency GPS. They also have studio speakers with Dolby Atmos. A 5000mAh battery keeps the Redmi K60 Pro running with support for 120W fast wire charging. One major improvement is the wireless charging. The Redmi K60 series support 30W fast wireless charging. And Redmi also introduced a dedicated charging pad that supports the same speed.
Redmi K60 series is already available in China and the prices are quite good. The Redmi K60 is offered in four colors, white, green, black and blue leather with carbon details on the sides. Price begins from 2500 RMB which is $360 for the 8GB RAM, 128GB internal storage and can go as high as 3600 RMB which can be $515 for the most powerful 16GB RAM, 512GB version. Just like the Pro, this Redmi K60 series sale starts on December 31st in Cross China. These phones are China exclusive currently but we also do expect these to launch globally in a couple of months. So guys, what do you think? The price could be same when it will have launched globally. You can share your thoughts about the smartphone. And uh, till then, I will see you in the next one. Please consider subscribe to my channel. Take care yourself. Bye.